Hello everyone and welcome to this detailed video on how to replace the damaged water inlet valve in your front loader Samsung washing machine. You'll need to replace this part if your washing machine is not filling with water. So, without wasting any more time, let's get right to it. In order to prevent any chances of electrocution, make sure your washing machine is disconnected from the power outlet before starting this repair. Also ensure that the water supply is turned off in order to prevent leaks. Depending on the location of your washing machine, you will need to pull the drain holes out of the standpipe for easier access to the back of the appliance. Next, you need to disconnect the water supply hose from the port at the back of the machine. Some water may spill out, so ensure that you have a rag. The next thing you need to do is take out the Phillips screws at the back of the machine, holding the top panel. With the screws removed, slide the top cover backwards about an inch or so, then lift it off the machine. Note the positioning of the connectors attached to the water inlet valve, then unplug each one. Take out the screws at the back of the machine holding the water inlet valve. Carefully pull the water inlet valve assembly out of the cabinet. Using a pair of pliers, squeeze the retaining clamps holding the outlet tubes to the ports on the inlet valve. Carefully pull each tube off the water inlet valve. Once you've taken out the old water inlet valve, all you need to do is connect the outlet tubes to the corresponding ports on the new water inlet valve. Secure the hoses by sliding the retaining clamps into place using a pair of pliers. Carefully push the new water inlet valve into place in the cabinet. Secure the new water inlet valve by applying the Phillips screws at the back of the cabinet. Plug each connector into its corresponding terminal on the new water inlet valve. Carefully mount the top cover back on the cabinet, then slide it into place. Apply the Phillips screws at the back of the machine to secure the top panel. Reconnect the water supply hose to the port at the back of the appliance. Reconnect your washing machine to the power outlet and turn the water supply back on. Once you've completed all these steps, try running a wash cycle to see if the problem has been fixed. 